You want to look at some toys? Well, we got toys for you. Well, first, we're an intensive base program. And second of all, we're a one-stop shop for families who have children with disabilities. We provide speech therapy, occupational therapy, physical therapy, ABA therapy, which is applied behavior analysis, and feeding and swallowing therapy. We're intensive base. We're typically not seeing the kids once or twice a week. It's usually three to five times per week because we're capitalizing on the neuroplasticity aspect of their brain. We're habilitating children, so we're teaching them skills they've never had. You gotta move your mouth. Um, 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 Can we swallow um, it? Being not only a, you know, a, an employee of Metro AHS, but also having a child that has been in occupational therapy, I can not only relate to them and give personal experience to what they would be doing, because um, a lot of times family will call, families will call and not really have any idea what, um, what occupational therapy is, what speech therapy is, what ABA therapy is. So being able to explain that from not just a employee's perspective, but also from a parent's perspective. Parents are thrilled. They, you know, especially the kids that might not have been able to talk are now talking and saying, hey, I love you, mom. Or they're allowing, you know, the parent to hug them, things that their child would never want. And some, you don't think that you're, you don't know what that's like until you walk in those shoes. So for just little things like that, parents are ecstatic. And the other thing is that they're happy that their kids are able to socialize and play and have fun with their peers because a lot of our children aren't able to. So we not only get them acclimated within their own family, we're getting them acclimated within their community, which is school, and the parents just can't be happier. I love football. You love football? Yes, I love it. I love football too. Me too. <laughs> Me, you too? You want to come in here? Knowing that this is where, you know, families are setting down roots here. They're, you know, this is where they're coming, and if the families are coming here, this is where the children are, so this is where we need to be. It's, uh, I could cry, because we really are, we're making a difference in kids' lives and families' lives, so. It's, uh, sometimes I try not to focus on that because of the tears that, you know, evokes, but um, the stories I've heard and the changes that we're making in kids' lives in the moment and then what an impact it's going to have when they become young adults, you know. Um, and I'm hoping at some point they give back to their community. We only just opened the center this year. I mean, it was just a couple months ago. And to see all of the families that come, to see all of the kiddos that are running around, like every single one of those people didn't have a place to go before. And now they do because we're here.